Happy Tuesday, everybody. It is July 6th, 2021. I'm Bryce Castillo, your pre-show navigator. Thank you for joining us here on the pre-show for Great Night, episode two. Uh, to give you a little bit of a tease before we go into the green room, uh, we're going to have one Brent, the Ram Trinker, Ounceville. We'll have Brett. Uh, we have two Bretts. Brett, Brett Weaver's still around. And, uh, uh, and yeah, the Amtracker is in town. Amtracker? Amtracker. Amtracker? Yeah, one of them. One of them. Got a game coming up for you from uh, BioCow. Got a fantastic game. I plussed it. So if BioCow is listening, he also he doesn't know how I've plussed it. Uh, uh, so we've got a guest here in the studio. Uh, uh, so hello, everybody. Welcome to Tuesday. Thank you for joining us. It's going to be a great night. Part part two all right we are gonna uh, let's see here we're gonna go live now to the green room to the green room uh where uh, i believe uh, i have some folks are already I talking i wonder if they can hear oh, us or no, not no, no, no. if you had your wisdom teeth out and your then experience it was, uh... was anything like mine it was full on they knocked you all the way out and is that weird, not laughing dude. gas? No, 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 no. Laughing gas is is just uh, uh, something to make you a little bit giggly. You're fully awake during the procedure. You oh, really? Don't really care? Yeah. yeah I uh, think this went uh, out with wisdom Steve Martin. teeth is just like I remember thinking. Oh, I'll show you. I'm gonna stay awake. <laughs> little shop of horrors tomorrow. Nice. Yeah. Let's call back. No, I I was awake when I I I'm missing. I was not born with a tooth. That like an adult tooth. I was congenitally missing a tooth, so I have a I have an I still, implant. I I still have a uh, baby tooth. Oh, you, really? Else have a baby tooth. I have uh, my wisdom teeth never came in. I have a box full of them at home. I had from all kinds of different babies. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you have them in a box. He is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. None of them yours. Nice. Yeah. Whenever he's feeling down, he just shakes them right next yeah. to his head. Like, and, that's and he goes, the, soon, "Hold on, <laughs> let's let's take a bite out of the day, Brad." Mm, <laughs> that's <laughs> actually <laughs> a really good question. People who buy other people's baby, creepy, not creepy. If buy so, other ooh, people's baby. You mean the tooth fairy? tooth fairy? I didn't want to go straight to the source, <laughs> but here we are. <laughs> Somebody's selling that shit on eBay. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what? hold on. There is. You're telling me that there is a trade of people on the internet that will buy and sell other strangers' baby teeth. Yeah. Bunny, to the internet. Here we go. I, I mean, no, I'll look it up right now. Here. <laughs> I mean, I you need, it, you need but to only because I believe people oh, yeah, yeah. buy everything. Yes. Siri, show me pictures of eBay baby teeth. <laughs> <laughs> this is a something that's gonna get oh you flagged. Have you guys seen like? What, what do you mean? Yeah, oh, there it is. Here we go. Well, it's just showing me a bunch of kids. That's not yeah. right. Have you seen photos of like a children's skull yes. with their baby teeth coming in? No, that that image will like haunt me for my entire life. What? It's the craziest thing. As it's so coming in, it's a it's a skull, a child's skull from an era when they are growing their baby teeth. They just look like like a crazy shark, shark. monster that's growing. Like rows like and rows, rows of rows. things. Yeah. Okay, is that's this like a thing that happens could. to a real person, or is it in a museum? Oh, that does happen. I hate to be the guy that pulls out a phone at the same time some other guy is the guy who pulls okay, out a phone. Okay, but, 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 but answer me. Where phone. do you think if the baby? You, both of you guys from. are showing me the most horrifying. Like this is like a dark, creepy version of. Yes. Uh, of I'm so proud of my kids. Like here we go. Here's All right, like, here's like, here's, 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 a, here's All right, start the song. Here's some like baby bottom shark, of the doo -doo, ocean doo -doo, doo -doo, uh, 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 fish, doo -doo, and Brian's gonna show me how you then sell it live eBay. from eBay. I have a uh, lot number two seventy three. Human teeth, baby, child, nine dental oh, research studies, God. real teeth art collections. Opening bid. Go. How many? Nineteen dollars. Well, it's a nine. Thirty-five fifty. Okay, well, I hear thirty-five fifty. One dollar. Hear... No, no, uh, Bonnie. <laughs> so close. Forty-nine ninety-nine. I was close. Wow. I was close. Wow. <laughs> wow. 
that's way more than a quarter. Man, these each. kids can pay for themselves. <laughs> I mean, just mark them. I mean, See, that's yeah, what happens. I was about to say, right? Yeah. So, a uh, question: If you could take a pill right show now, the okay, picture, wait, show the wait, hold on, picture. hold on, hold on. Here's a oh, question. Good oh, God. Wait, no, well, I guess I should probably yeah, show that picture. Like too, show that picture. Yeah. yeah. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. No. 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 Yours is fine. Yeah. Yours is fine. Look at this other one. Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, Look yeah, at this other one. Uh, yes, it's pre-production art from uh, Alien versus Predator. Yeah. <laughs> but this is a real thing. That's this is this is a child's skull showing their baby teeth. This I mean, was all of I us. I guess it tells its own story that it's a skull. <laughs> it's, 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 it's promo material. This is what for, happens uh, when creepy men say to war. tell someone to smile. You should smile more. Oh, you smile so, too much. Question: If you could take a pill right now. Yes. And over the next <laughs> this is gonna end two with years you on the, in the fair, isn't it? <laughs> no. And over the next two years, every single one of your teeth will fall out. However, a new adult tooth will replace it, and you will have a brand new set of teeth. Would you engage in this practice? Now yes. you will. Uh, oh, okay. That's a that's an how many yes. how many all of them? Uh, no, but how many rounds? What's our, what's many, our lifespan yeah. of this? Uh, oh, I don't know. Or, or, I mean, is, it, or is it whenever you take a pill? However good your current adult teeth are, they're they're even better but, because they're brand new. Yes. 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 Yeah, so yeah. so you're 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 not going to mind going around looking nope. like a hockey player? No. Nope. No. Nope. Okay. What Already look like a hockey I don't know, player. Man, my it's teeth fine. rule. <laughs> <laughs> look at these i'm looking at bonnie's smile right. and it's like that's that is a tough one uh i, I mean the lovely I, I smile you have in, do they come in like pre braces and everything like you get them like right Ooh, back are they jacked up the yeah, yeah i'm not rolling them dice no chance to know for sure whether or not they're gonna come in straight and also not. i kind of feel like like when i was a kid things were a lot more malleable like now my skull kind of only has one way to go if yeah. it's gonna screw up it's gonna be really screwed up that's right <laughs> and then i gotta be the dude with a retainer at 40 fuck that plus also like uh shout out to all my dudes with a retainer i was at gonna 40. say that's what invisalign <laughs> is for invisalign invisalign I never did that. braces is that a, me neither, is that a, what? Is no my teeth way. <laughs> yeah me neither oh these old things fuck all y'all <laughs> fuck all y'all with your perfect teeth we had beautiful rock tooth grins and our children have beautiful rock tooth grins as my friend would say my my teeth are like some shit that's what my friend he's like i had to get <laughs> braces why because my my teeth no he's talking about himself <laughs> yeah no they look at me and they're like fuck you that's exactly you know. <laughs> uh yeah all of a sudden i don't know if i would like uh, in fact because because i think what you were thinking was a clean like a clean, a clean slate. slate. Yeah. So basically, right. you have good teeth, you get new good teeth. Right. right. Well, or, yeah. or at least healthy, fresh teeth or whatever, you know? And it's like, maybe you have to do braces again for a little bit. I don't even think I'd mind that. But 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 knowing the reality of just getting implants of a perfectly aligned set of teeth and then being able to do, if nothing else, being able to bite into an ice cream cone yeah. and <laughs> stare right in the eyes yeah. everyone losing their mind oh. as you slowly sink your fake oh. teeth into but they're not fake or, or dentures yeah yeah okay. yeah, 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 yeah like, okay, like that's uh, that's my mom used to torture me she's she's got a crown up top you know? i, I so had wait, an uncle she would just be able to eat ice cream yeah be, well well because she has no nerve endings in her yeah in, her, in the teeth up front and so she would just house ice she, cream she, like no no no. she, she ah. would take ice cream and she would explain oh look what i get to do and go ah. yeah I, I i had an uncle that had uh the the two front ones were fake yep and uh, he would say, hey, may, may come here, come here a second. He said, I want you and to you get me and you as go, hard and as you can. You come, and he'd take the back of his tongue and push those teeth out like like the the alien from, you know, from Alien. Yeah. They'd come and he'd come. Yeah. They were like, no, no, no. Luckily, we weren't, you know, really aggressive. Like, no, bash. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to give you a couple more loose. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be a more effective illusion the next time should, you try to screw around. Should we maybe explain to anybody listening on audio and, or, or, or video that's not live who all is in the room? Uh, yes, indeed. We are joined by Brett the Amtrekker, Roundsville. Howdy. Man, old school. And then new school, uh, Brett the 
the the the anime trekker <laughs> weaver <laughs> i I'm, I'm always interested in how you're going to label me you know, like, <laughs> what are we, I, what are I we actually, doing this week I, I had that thought of of whether or not you wanted to be permanently associated with the anime voice work that you've done in the past right uh, or not so let me ask you would you like me to continue to permanently associate you with the anime? I am not ashamed of class? anything that I've ever done. Yeah. So. <laughs> Wait, no, but, 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 but also it's such, it's, it's a good hook. The idea that it's like, I probably have already heard this man's voice. Yeah. Is something that I like. Yeah. Especially if you play smite, you've heard my voice. Uh, smite. Wait, is that the, the, the pirate one? No, that's no. one piece. Oh. By the way, which uh, the first three seasons of One Piece are on uh, on Netflix right now, and I'm on the first three seasons of, of One, Piece. One Piece. Gotcha. That I did twenty years ago. Oh wow! Oh. Yeah. So, uh, Mister One, Mister One is in that. Ha, um, knowing that that uh, that humans age in your recordings <laughs> do not. <laughs> yes. Uh, when you encounter those moments, how do, how how do they land with you? Um, actually, I got to hear my first show that I ever did, which was called Burn Up W, and they redid. No, not Burn Up W. It's uh, I was in Burn Up W, but there's another one called gunsmith cats and they just re they re um remastered it? remastered them and i got to hear it and i haven't heard it in 20 something years and and did you recognize yourself yes okay but i was like oh my voice has dropped a little bit since then and man i would have played that character different <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's a weird thing where the voice you know your voice was higher but mine like noticeably changed in like my mid-20s yeah. Like I went from having a higher voice to having a, a much lower and gravelier voice to the point where people like thought I had like no it, like like surgery. Yeah, problems. That, that, old, yeah. that old voice surgery. Yeah. No, people were like people were like like uh, like oh are you like sick or something? And I'm like I'm like no. Could you clear your voice? Could you clear yeah. your throat a little like, bit? You should like, like sing a no. blues album. And I'm like, that's the weirdest insult I've ever <laughs> <Yeah>. heard. <laughs> <laughs> like if it were 2021, I would have called him racist. <laughs> have you ever thought about pretending you're a cancer patient? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine, like, somebody raises to the station of a president, and it's like, uh, so, Mr. President, yes, yes, go ahead. You should sing a blues album. Yeah. <laughs> like, what do you say to that? Well, I, don't know. I had no idea. When people are asking who you voiced in Smite, I'm the uh, the lead narrator uh, in Smite, the one oh. who introduces everybody. Damn, yeah. bitch. Yeah. So w w when you do get asked to, like, do the thing whatever the thing is what is the thing they ask you to do uh for a long time i was asked to sing the afro song from uh excel saga because i played this character named nabishin and i sang a song about an afro about his afro he had an afro he has an afro gotcha yeah it's uh, the the director of the show is named uh shinichi watanabe okay but Oh, wait, 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 wait. Of the Connecticut one? To the, well, yes. <laughs> God, someone who understands. Wait a minute. Uh, 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 Watanabe, uh, did he do Cow Cowboy Bebop? Or... No, that's Shinichi Watanabe. Got it, got no, it, got it. Shinichiro Watanabe did Cowboy Bebop. Got it. Shinichi Watanabe did Nabishin. Got it, got it, got it, got it. And at some point, somebody has an afro. Yes, and he has an afro. In real life. He writes himself into most of the cartoons that he does. Gotcha. And in that, he sings a song about his afro. That you sang. That I sang. And is popular, and people ask you. It was popular for a while. Do you enjoy singing it? Um, most of the time, I can't remember the words, because so I did it that we one were time. to three, two, one. Next week. Ba -da -da, next week. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> then I got high. And then I got high. <laughs> yeah. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, so wait, hold on. So you will sing the Afro song? I'll sing the Afro song next week. Hell yeah. You, but you have no idea what the lyrics are right now. Da, 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 my, name, da, da, da. my name is Nabashin and my afro suits wait, me. Wait, wait, why are you trying to kill next week's bit? No, 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 no. I'm just, I'm just curious. Like, 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 don't have to brush, just watch. All right, 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 right. Here, we, we'll, we'll get it. A big performance <laughs> next yes. week, everybody. Tune yes. in to the but, afro but, By the way, that'll be the punishment. That'll be the punishment for the game is the real stakes 
will be that one of us have, have to, to sing. sing back up for a song we have never heard. It's on YouTube. You can catch it <laughs> oh, on YouTube. No. So. Oh, I, I ain't prepping to lose. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm just oh, yeah. going to win whatever the game is. Are you kidding exactly. me? I'm going to do the easy thing and just win right. the game. So Brian's got to sing it. Uh, so uh, 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 Brett has been here since the very, very beginning. But uh, it occurs to me that this is the first time we get to chat very briefly about how we felt about our inaugural episode of great night last week. Like I, I, I know we got the post, you know, that euphoric high of like, yeah. Oh my God, we rock so hard or whatever. There were high but, fives, the highest of fives. Uh, uh, well, I could think of a way they could have been higher. Uh, <laughs> with drugs, oh. <laughs> <laughs> but, 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 uh, an uh, artist that you immediately internalize that criticism. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're like, like, it could have been higher. And then we were just like, Oh, really? <laughs> Please, what did I do? Okay. <laughs> But uh, but now that we've all Managed sat with it for a week, uh, I got I got to be honest, Brett. Seeing you uh, 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 be here, I was just like, he came back. <laughs> like, I, and I know I shouldn't be surprised. To this. I know I know I shouldn't be surprised, but but it's validating. It has and been I'm in excited. every conversation we've had with Weaver. Is yes, you being shocked that we're having a conversation with Weaver. <laughs> I'm I'm literally surprised anybody watches our horse sure. shit. That's 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 <laughs> sure. bedrock. Uh, a side comment, I had a friend from uh, Two Jobs Back text me and say, you know Justin? Really? <laughs> and I was like, yeah, I did a thing with him. He's like, yeah, how did you get into that? I was like, they asked me. <laughs> did, did they have a casting call? <laughs> yeah, they're like, did bro, you apply? Can you brother up? <laughs> How do you get into that? The same thing as voice acting. How do you become a voice actor? You lose a bet. That's yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, but back to the question, just to wrap things up. Yes. Uh, uh, hot damn, man. Even a week later, it feels so magical. Yep. It feels like like so many things came together. Uh, and part of me wants to be terrified about trying to replicate that success tonight. But the bigger part of me is just like, no, this is the new normal. Do is the is we do, the, do thing. the thing. Yeah. Uh, we, we got a creeping yeah, Corey we, we, in the corner. We creeping Corey. We got a triple C. He's like, <laughs> well, no, no, it's just Corey. You popped, you popped into the room with a sudden kind of like chipmunk like urgency yeah. that made me like think that there was like a note that you had to pass along. Yeah. Okay. No, Corey. No worries. It's just in and out. Uh, uh, yeah. I mean, I think that what's amazing about the 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 spaceship that we've built is that there's a lot of places we can go. We're gonna go a few more of them. Uh, uh, tonight, tonight, uh, appearing live on the show will be, uh, uh no, we're not going to, it's a surprise. We don't want people to stay around. Well, I mean, I think they'll stay around, but I mean, would they stay around more if we told them about a surprise? <laughs> I believe we it's called a radio it. tease. Go a ahead. Radio tease. Yeah. A, a musical guest tonight and we'll leave it there. That's pretty uh, good. Yeah, that's that's fair. Yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. We're going to have a fun musical guest. Uh we have uh uh I don't know, just this studio and and also the fact that it keeps collecting people. People just keep kind of showing up. In fact, I was saying on the morning stream today like trying to lay the seeds for uh, uh Scott Johnson and Brian Ibbett to come on down here for a, a night which which also, would be amazing. Yeah, and also makes it uh we were talking about this the other day that so much stuff gets produced in either in this facility physically or between my house and this facility that like, you know, uh, Heaton is going to come into town next week and he's going to do the morning stream with me. He's going to do PX3 with me. He's going to come in here and do night attack. And that's all on Tuesday, you know, and then he could do a, 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 a scam nation. He could do a modern rogue. Like there's a lot of stuff where he's plugging a book. And now that's six shows he can do with free lodging uh, if, if you know, for anybody who's got a channel or product or anything, which is like really cool. Along that same uh, line of thought, today we needed to shoot a uh, an ad and it's a fairly extended integrated ad. Well, God damn it. I said night attack. The great night. Oh, oh you got the bell. bell. I got the bell. I got the bell. I got the bell. I got the bell. <laughs> Shoot him with the thing. <laughs> Shoot, Shoot him, him with the, the bell. bell. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, uh, today we are leg. leg. <laughs> today, 
take your medicine. <laughs> Today we were doing a, uh, a, a an ad shoot, and I was like, ah, what we need is it shouldn't be on set because that's where we do the uh, modern rogue show. It shouldn't be, you know, that's a, a great night set is too much of a stage and it would, it would be weird to be at the podcast uh, set. What I want is something that feels like a living room. That would be a natural conversation that, Oh my oh. God. Area where there might yeah. be a camera. Like a, like a bunch of yellow, Ooh. blue like <laughs> room. That's what I I'm looking for, <laughs> uh, but uh, uh, Brett, uh, uh, what about you? Uh, the the morning out. Sorry, uh, real Brett. We were. Uh, oh, uh, no, wow. not Shadow Brett. <laughs> Shadow, Whoa, Shadow so Brett right. is here tonight. It's okay, man. It's all right. It's all right. It happens. Yeah, I'm older. It's fine. So. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, the Brett that was there last week. Yes. <laughs> after the fact, uh, what uh, were there any epiphanies or anything that that struck you? Uh, everything I'm excited about. And enough to where I posted it through my website and let everybody know. And uh, other people are starting to reach back to me. And I'm really, I, I think it's great. I'm really excited. And I've been writing down, again, the uh, opening for tonight's. Awesome. Yeah. Started putting that together. Yeah. So uh, we are being reminded by the great and powerful Bryce Neshkom Castillo yes. that uh, we did set up a bit yes. last week. Um, last week, uh, Amtrekker, the intro was from an undisclosed location. Uh, the 13th titty is forbidden. Yes. Uh, <laughs> uh, please welcome, uh, uh, Justin and Brian. It's a great night. Yes. Uh, so now we need to come up with an intro I, I, each I, week until we get bored. I've so started we need, with we one until we get you. bored. Yeah. We will eventually forget about this and, yeah. and. There'll be just one person that chat. I'll That's just like, be right. intro question mark? I, I, I feel like it's almost like we ripped off that moment from Starship Troopers, where it's just like, uh, we need a voice announcer. It's you until uh, 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 until uh, until you die, or I find somebody better. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so uh, uh, Weaver's got got some stuff down, but but let's let's see if we can get something from you here. If uh, you've been around this show for longer than this show. Uh, in any form has has existed so uh, uh, uh what, what do you think what do you think for yeah. an intro uh i don't know geez maybe we could lean heavy into the idea that it may or may not ha be happening like uh like allegedly they're okay <laughs> <laughs> i mean i guess real brett has it taken care of uh, <laughs> uh, apparently there is real brett we are looking at at at, at two brett's no that's great one <laughs> brett, you know a, a, a if station you can read my handwriting oh i cannot okay. that is a, it, it, that was, is, it was scrawly yeah no those are not even <laughs> it's letters weird. what I is that is that a cat that's <laughs> It's a schwa. Oh. Sorry, I shouldn't put schwas in there. Uh, uh, all right, so so what were you thinking? That that this may or may not be happening yeah. uh, uh, from a plane of existence uh, right. yep. blinking on the eye of reality? <laughs> I mean, that's all great. Run sure, with it. No, Have fun yeah. with it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Can uh, we? Can, uh, how much are we allowed to say? Because uh, we'd probably say it here and not on, on, on the uh, main... Uh, on the big show uh how much can we talk about the reason you're here in austin oh we can talk about all you want uh obviously i'm here to murder the three of you oh, <laughs> god damn it i knew it i called it, steal your baby called teeth. it before you even like, showed up uh, let me tell you they're going like, for a price if you, mm. if you think baby teeth are expensive <laughs> wait till you see how much grown-up teeth go for <laughs> Meanwhile, the chat room is like, uh, two Bretts want to be on great night. Now let them fight now. Uh, no, we can talk about it all we want. There's a, there's a website called nearbyatx.com that uh, we're spinning up. There's nothing there right now except like a place to put an email address. But uh, I'm in town to help make it easier for Austin to support Austin shops. So nice. this was uh, started out in Oakland. Yep. Uh, uh, as, as a way for people to be able to enjoy like two day shipping that you normally get from other, uh, gigantic faceless conglomerates. But yeah. in this way, you are going to support from all weirdos who businesses. go to space. They just say no weirdos, no space. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> yeah. And I'm going to just go ahead and make a wild guess that it, that wasn't called nearby ATX. 
maybe oh. nearby Oakland. <laughs> it was actually called Keep Oakland Alive, and it's still there. There we go. And yeah. then, uh, and then we are now expanding into other markets, and this is our second market. It's gonna be well. Uh, I know somebody. I mean, that's... It's basically sorry. It's basically like all the things you get from Amazon with two changes. One. All of the items are coming from shops near two, you. no space. Yeah. And, two, <laughs> and then all the money stays in your local economy. So like not in space. No not, shot not in space. Man, that's our golden promise. <laughs> <laughs> our money will not be shot in space. Unlike, <laughs> unlike Fairsley's. <laughs> Fairsley's. <laughs> I've got your first client, a guy who sells parking lot eggs. We can, uh, Get him hooked up. Sorry, what, what a parking, parking lot, lot eggs? eggs? <laughs> That's a guy who goes to the parking lot and sells eggs there. What? Yes. Like chicken eggs? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, are, what are you, what are you, you a <laughs> Could be chicken eggs, could be quail eggs, could be duck eggs. Just like any eggs. Kind of, where does he find the eggs? He just could be rattlesnake eggs. eggs. <laughs> no, he, he has a, what is he like juggling them? He's like, just a dude that's got a bunch of eggs and he do you sells think he just them. climbs trees all day, every day, and he goes, egg! And that is takes my, it to the nearest parking lot? It sure makes me think it is now. Where yeah. is where is this man? Uh, this is... Uh, He's uh, in the parking lot. He told that at the beginning lot. of the show. I know which parking lot. Uh, it's, all uh, of them. It's in the... Uh, <laughs> it's in the, if the people, parking lot. In your heart. In your heart. <laughs> it's the second space. <laughs> in your heart. Uh, it's in the uh, Crestview area of Austin. Okay. Uh, uh, and he's a noted neighborhood He has character. been doing this for 15 years. Climbing trees and stealing eggs. Stealing eggs. <laughs> he looks like a fox. He actually looks like a literal fox. <laughs> he's a silver fox. He's yes. Anderson Because he's older. It's yeah. 15 years. Exactly. Yeah, he's been doing it for a while. And he's like, hey, buddy, you want some yeah. eggs? Who wants to buy eggs from Daddy? Yeah, <laughs> got some pocket lot <laughs> eggs right here. Oh, yeah. What are we? What are, what are we feeling? Uh, uh, Robin, <laughs> <Wait a> frog, <laughs> rattlesnake. Do you have some frog eggs? Robin, Robin, Robin. Let's see, Robin, <laughs> Robin. <laughs> Robin. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Robin <laughs> eggs. Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> yeah. Here, let me pull that out of your ear. Yeah. Somebody's got dirty ears. <laughs> I just wanted a quarter. You get a. <laughs> Imagine how old that bit gets when you're the, the nephew or niece of that person. Yeah, yeah. Like, okay, yeah, like, yeah, oh God, he's it. coming to get his ear. He's like, have you been washing? Like, I don't, just pull do it. it. Yeah. Even in 120 degree weather, it's a velour smoking jacket. Uncle Brian, just do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'm reading a detective novel. What type? <laughs> oh, let me guess. Hard boiled. <laughs> I just it suddenly it just turned into where you're talking about the pulling. It's like it's Brian's life. That's Brian's yeah, life. I know. One day, one day it's a bit. It's a bit. It's a bit on. Silver Fox Eggman. <laughs> Silver Fox Eggman. Gonna team up. Is going to be my ultimate uh, 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 magnum opus. It's going to be. It does Eggman. your final form. You know that, that Brian. Brian is in his ultimate power when he's when he's in the parking it's lot. So, torch. It Silver does, Fox it does feel Eggman, like a... and it's like Ken Burns cut to, uh, and he's and Silver Fox Eggman says, "My only regret." Is I never killed Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like a real no, time no. as a flat circle moment to me. Like yeah. we're just gonna watch him sitting in a room explaining his life. <laughs> and then the parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, having said that, like my parents, my parents have a bigger house. Uh, I believe they have more of their property dedicated to making chickens happy than they have their actual living For space. Themselves yes. making themselves. Happy. Yes, they have an entire house and 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 a jungle gym and fences around fences. And they live yeah, in yeah, yeah. They 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 have, they have one male and a whole bunch of females, and sure. they all they're like. Every single time, and 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 I don't want to in any way uh, imply that that I'm not thrilled every time, but I don't believe for months I've left their property without them saying 
Last thing. Take some eggs. Would you like some eggs? Yeah. <laughs> not, even, not even asking. I mean, take some eggs. I mean, that's the thing is, is, is like, well, I mean, yes, you won at life. You have like, like that fantasy, that bullshit fantasy sure. of farm fresh, cage yes. free, with yeah, happy wonderful. chickens, eggs. Sure. Like that's all a lie at HEB. It's a reality at my parents' place. Yes. Uh, but also, man, that's a lot of eggs. And I, I mean, unless I want to get up early enough to go to the parking lot on time, I, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Maybe you can sell those eggs to the parking lot eggs guy. Ooh. Oh, that would take all the fun out of it. Yeah, I'm positive. If he can go on the hunt, why bother? I mean, right. you know what he does? Is he, sells at a, he sells at a profit. Where do those profits go? Beep. Right to space. <laughs> <laughs> These fuckers. He's like, I'm so glad Eventually, Elon is they here. all just shoot the money into space. Yeah. Uh, all right, one question for you, Brian. Which parking lots are your dad hanging out at? Because <laughs> I think we figured it out. Yeah. <laughs> Silver <Is> Fox. It... <laughs> I go over. You can't see it on the live chat, but yeah, I've got just... a gigantic Pepe Silvia board. <laughs> yeah. like, He's over there. Fox, question mark. Eggman? Question mark. Like it's circle. all connected. And, connected. And it's like a. And he only sells them until around five forty-five. And he always says, "I gotta hurry this up. Fox and Friends is about to start." Uh, <laughs> now I got him. I like the thing. It's just it's a board that really only has two notes on it. One that says Eggman, and one that's a picture of Brian's dad with one <laughs> one, one string that goes across. <laughs> Solved it. That's, that's a great idea. The laziest conspiracy detective. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like the murderer, my dad. Yeah. <laughs> got it's it. Like, it's like a, the court board is only the book, <laughs> the book depository, and the limo. <laughs> And it's like, a single yeah. line. He's like, and he looks down at all the other detectives with like all the different pictures. He's like, Bullshit. I don't know, he's man, like, wait, what are you made of yarn? Yeah. Wait, wait, going he's, like, he's like, what? Oh, well, there's this guy that comes in a parking lot every day. <laughs> he's got a bunch of yarn. You're in the pocket of big yarn. <laughs> That's the only reason he has the board because he's got so much yarn. Exactly. <laughs> Uh, you're you're under the thumb of Otto von Yarnenstein, Man. the big yarn magnate of the of Connecticut the von Yarnensteins. <laughs> hey man, there's a whole cartel. They're called the Spinners. No, no. The Yarnman. The Yarnman. Yeah, that's my favorite British tell invasion. Yarn, yeah. They tell long uh, oh, tales. Oh, oh, oh yeah, no, no, no. Wait, we're not we're not leaving this till we solve it. The uh, the the uh, 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 uh what up my nittas uh, what whoa whoa whoa, 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 whoa. hey hey ho oh, hey. Fuck, fuck, fuck you <laughs> you you three are the egg people <laughs> <laughs> don't mean to egg well, you on looks like the <laughs> eggs no. on your face <laughs> no. yeah. yeah we're like that. <laughs> no <laughs> no <laughs> Uh, we've all become entwined with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck you, fuck you, yeah. fuck you. It's just a picture of Brian and the way and then <laughs> <laughs> No, refuse. Refuse. Oh, it's, it's actually going to It's going to loop a couple of times. God damn just it. To make sure. <laughs> it loops. He puts four yards. Yeah. More. <laughs> It's like, why do you put multiple? Just so I Yo, know. man, we Just got a gang. Sure. We call yeah. ourselves the friendship bracelet bracelets. Mm -mm. <laughs> No. <laughs> no. Look, I, I'm just gonna keep trying keep until trying. I crawl I'm, out. Hey, mm. no, we got it. We got it. We got I'm it. encouraging. You can do it. No. Yeah. No, it's Let's not possible. Go. Let's go. Okay, this is a real Gordian knot I'm trying to solve right nice. now. Just yes. cut it. Okay. Just cut it. it. Yes. Uh oh. Okay. That's the yeah. That's the Gordian. Nice. Yeah. Right. Brian, Gordian knot, one strand. <laughs> <laughs> With only the one strand just has this big old ball That's in the middle. Ball, the middle. <laughs> what do I do? Just cut it. <laughs> that one's easier. <sighs> <sighs> Shit, man. Uh, we got we got 13 minutes for call time. Um, uh, how are we feeling, Brett? What do you? Uh, what do you? Do you have any? Do you even like do the like? Oh, I have to eat food here. Yeah. Austin do you even do that thing like, where you're uh, like, oh, I have to eat food? So times. Oh, my body's in Austin. I have to eat food. Do you do? Do you, do you even do, you do eat that? Food, Brett? Hey, since you barely <laughs> exist like, on this plane, against me trying to get through the. Next hey, man, minutes. you're the one who fucking called me a racist. <laughs> <laughs> you said a thing. <laughs> I mean, I 
did we call you All a racist? I did was, or did you whoa, put a big sign oh, over your head? Oh, <laughs> I basically just did the oh, thing so before I'm walking here. Hey, yo, <laughs> yo. Do you do oh, this thing? But I know I don't uh, eat food. I don't eat food right now. Yeah, yeah. Austin, like, I gotta go eat barbecue or breakfast tacos yeah. or anything. Like Only that. he calls it breakfast. It's really annoying. <laughs> breakfast. Ah, <laughs> jeez. Oh, Has have you ever gotten that? Has breakfast? anybody ever called it breakfast? <laughs> no, but no. he did name okay, a fucking neither. month That's after why I was himself. Like, that was really that was good, <laughs> and I've never <laughs> heard it before. <laughs> I think. I have a, this memory. I was working at Disney World, and I was on the uh, I was on the parade route, and this little girl looked up at me, and she was probably like seven or eight, and she was such a little snot, and she was like, "Brett, what is that short for?" And I was like, well, "I don't know, darling. What do you think it's short for?" And she goes, "I don't know, Brett Tholomew." And I said, <laughs> "I said no, it's actually long for br." <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> and her dad lost it, and she just gave me a dirty look oh, and walked sure, away and made no no sound. Him. Uh, anyway, uh, seven yeah. year olds. So I look, yeah, you're stupid. Your yeah. brain's small. I want their My teeth. brain's big. That shit's hilarious. <laughs> your dad laughed. I win and you, you came lose. out of his balls. <laughs> I win. You know what? Your dad Mickey's thinks he, I'm funnier than you. So anyway, buy you want to buy these eggs? Yeah. <laughs> Plus one for bruh. 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 I like, Mickey's just I, I like a girl in a suit. Bartholomew. Brett, Brett Tholomew. Tholomew? Yeah. I, I have been called Brett Tholomew before. Yeah, I've gotten that one. Uh, really? You know what my... There's no way what, that's a real name at all. You know what my oh, family I don't think taunt was for me? Your because, family taunt. Sorry, your taunt. Oh, taunt. So, so, uh, 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 time, do you have time, a lot of... Time, yeah. time, 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 time out. out on the concept of a family taunt. Yes. yes. Because I, I understand a sibling taunt. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I understand a coy with a wink and a smile from an extended family member. No. But a whole family, like the thing your whole family used to call you I have a, as a taunt. I have an older brother and three older sisters. So to me, that's the family that yeah. taunted me. They all did it. Because we all had ones for each other. Gotcha. Right. Yeah. Just snide nicknames. Yes. That was like, like, hey, could... asshole. Yeah. 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 I mean, yeah. that's yeah. Yeah. so. So like my sister, uh, whose name is Simone, we called her Sea Monster. That's Sea gotcha. Monster. Yeah. For me, it was longer. It was Brett the Brett, the big and yellow rat. That's oh, my what... gosh. That is almost the exact same thing. I'm not joking. It was, that was weird. Yeah. Uh, let's do it up here. Okay. Uh, it was, it was, it was, it was Brett Brett the Rug I love, Rat. I love that. that was yeah, the weird for judgment for audio, for audio listeners. <laughs> yeah, uh, we were went in. It for was a the widest high low. And, and, and Brett came in and then just gave him like, a, we're not there yet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Maybe later like, tonight we can low five. Like, still that big man. It was we're keeping it above go, go high. High. It was like a gentle move from the upper thigh He's to like, the bro. knee. Yeah. Yeah. Like, bro, bro, bro. It's too much. Uh, <laughs> So the yeah, Brett the rug rat the same thing. Yeah, Brett Brett the rug rat. Rug rat. I think. Yeah, yeah that's Brett the Brett the big and yellow rat. That's so weird. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who knew? And I used to always I go doesn't hey, even rhyme with because then they would say big Brett the Brett, and then I owned it by going, hold on, I'm also a big and yellow rat. Don't don't. I want all of it. Yeah. So they were they <laughs> were like, nothing. yeah. Come on now. Were, were you the longest nickname? Yes. Everybody else's was like one. Michael word. Motorcycle, Don oh. the Fawn, Francine, Fat Scene, Fart Scene. Ooh, oh, good. that was that was that pushing was, it. Yeah, that's pretty long. Fran and then Simone, Sea Monster. Scene, yeah, fart I mean, scene? family yes. family taunts are a thing, though. You yes. guys have them too, do you not? I think uh, I think the most I have, uh, what like crying Brian. Um, I don't remember too much. Uh, uh, now, now uh, uh, the uh, unfortunate thing is that my last name was the bigger target you know but would run uh, that's a good one actually it kind of stops there right <laughs> yeah. the longest I mean, one like that that's what that's one when i start teaching certain magic tricks the magic community starts to, to write like yeah. at the age of like 43 they're all like <laughs> brian bought one yeah. <laughs> more like the, am i right the, the longest one that's in my extended family is my uncle henry but you know, no, I'm Cajun, and so it's in French, and it was Henri Body Capitan Sui, which is Henry King of the Pigs or Captain of the Pigs. <laughs> nice, Henri Body Capitan Sui. That's pretty good, actually. Yeah, that was really. I good. would like Sui that. is just he would pig have in French me to death if I ever said that to him to his face. He didn't like it. No. Did he fuck pigs? 
No, Ooh. he's captain of the pigs. I mean, well, I know, look, but I'm not here to encourage anybody. You're just it's, saying. it's called prima nocta for a reason. I don't want to yuck, <laughs> like, yuck anybody's yum. I'm just saying. Uh, I'm not, I mean, I don't know amongst the pig fucking community what you refer to that as. <laughs> uh, Justin, just do you have any dramatic right now, nicknames you want to share? Not that I haven't apparently suppressed. <laughs> if they I oh, can't salty think of Tushwood, any. apparently. Yeah, oh, uh, that's, that's a good nice. one. I haven't. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. Mister Nine Eleven, they call me. Well, you. Yes. <laughs> that's one you've gotten by reputation. Ah, for starting Nine Eleven. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> you just know it's, it's always the bluest guys from Brian Brushwood. <laughs> <laughs> Make a beer, call it the Brewers. I, I almost put this in the first segment, but I, oh, really? I really, I want to get away from 9/11 okay. humor on this show. Okay, it's a new, I, we're turning the page, but there was <laughs> a thing on Reddit today that I don't know whether it's fake or not, but uh, the the tweet was from New York City, and like a gorgeous picture of the New York City skyline, and it was just. Uh, uh, the the rainiest day in New York City is better than the sunniest day in Cleveland. <laughs> and then somebody else quote tweeting it with saying, like, I never remember a sunny day in Cleveland looking like this. And then just oh, got, oh, oh god damn it. So, it was a sunny, clear day. Oh, so oh. there we go. A night a little fun 9-11 joke to put into the pre-show. <laughs> never forget. Like all, yeah, yeah, just uh, to show we uh, haven't fight, changed. Fight, fuck, fuck you, because all of this is gonna go under my ledger, yep. and they're <laughs> they're not gonna remember oh, no. I'm that it was old it on your stick. Uh, uh, Tower 7 gerbs. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to Building 7? <laughs> That's where we kept all the 9-11 jokes. <laughs> control to Building 7. Control to Building 7. You've got five minutes. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, five minutes. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, Thank you, five. Uh, <laughs> Brett's. Brett's. Uh, 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 is there anything you guys want to plug? I did already. Yeah, I did yeah. My thing. So at uh, nearbyatx.com. Oh, uh, com. actually, yep. are 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 you in a position to at least hint on what kind of time schedule you're looking at? Because, uh, uh, in in plain speaking terms, I mean, basically, what if you could get shit on your doorstep, same as that other place, only your money does not get shot into a good steering wheel that does not fly into space. <laughs> the profits that stay in your city. Yeah. Uh, how, how soon can Austin hope to participate? In oh, this? real soon. Like, uh, it would it would be a matter. Would of you days. say it's nearby? Yeah, it was very nearby. And if, if you are going to spread to other cities, do I also have to move to them? Uh, yeah, since yeah. we started in Oakland where I, I mean, lived and then I moved here yeah. and it, immediately it, it, like turns out we got the real reason do I, do I, do I have to move to Minneapolis out? next and I mean, the, the thing is, short it's up to you you can ruin everything by never leaving <laughs> so it'll only be <laughs> yeah. like, city Shit, we can't or I can be like lie. this this a uh, uh, local Johnny retail, Appleseed, Johnny Appleseed mm -hmm. and just move eventually across the country so everybody can get local goods yeah. delivered on a or you could really just scale. you could just fuck with us and we'd be like all right we've got Austin and he's in Charleston <laughs> <laughs> meanwhile it's like the, the, Delta team Echo team I need you to converge he's a state area yeah, repeat tri-state area we'll, we'll get him this city <laughs> <laughs> no Vacation? He can just leave whatever he wants. He's in Rome. <laughs> hey, uh, just got a nice comment from the chat. Somebody who had just shown up for the first time this week. Uh, thank you very much for joining us, saying that we're looking good. And uh, I think we're, I guess we should probably wrap it up. So, because we're 13 minutes from go time. Sure. Uh, welcome to the green room. Uh, we hope you guys are enjoying it. If there's anything you guys want to see in this part of the three episodes we release immediately the following day, possibly yeah. the same day, let us know at what? Great, great, at great uh, night live. Let's say, let's say it together. Night live. Let us know at Wait, sorry, Johnny no, Eggman no, C. Bryce was saying great, on, great on night live okay. at great night live is the Twitter. Yeah, at great night live great night on live. Twitter. Uh, and, uh, uh, yeah, uh, green room show post show all goes out same day bonus show, uh, recorded on Thursdays goes out to patrons only at patreon.com slash. I have two green things night. to plug. Yo. Yeah. Uh, one is, Hey guys, notice that on Amazon that, uh, Evangelion 
thrice upon a time is going to be showing be really nice if you guys watch that <gasps> like if everybody were to hit play on it at the same time maybe that some of the people too. maybe on their way to space on somebody their way to would space. notice oh my goodness <laughs> so that's, evangelion is doing very well very well Just okay saying. all right that's right a good on. one to watch and uh, also uh, go to my uh, website uh, weightlesspod.com wait, so wait say it again weightlesspod dot com weightless yeah. weightless w e i g h t l e s s yes P -O pod dot com like our money in space yes because there's content there that i made once upon a time and you might like some of it hells yeah that. hells yeah uh all right well all right we're gonna turn it over we got a great show for you guys and uh, wait wait do we have the intro yeah, i have the intro all right well you guys are gonna have to wait another 13 minutes to hear uh uh weaver do it live live hey. great night. uh yes one more thing uh, uh I, I, I we're serious when we say feedback 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 hit us up on twitter uh we hope you guys are loving it we're trying real hard for you uh make some noise let's make some noise i love you guys yeah, yeah. yeah all right we'll see you out there have Bye. a great night Hello, everybody. Welcome back to uh, the Night Attack Pre- ah! <laughs> Welcome back to the Great Night <laughs> Pre-Show. I'm still Bryce Castillo. Fuck, man. Fuck. I thought- <laughs> Ah, I thought I thought they wouldn't get me. I thought it wouldn't get me, but you know what? That's how it goes. Hello, everybody. Uh, we're gonna do some birthdays here. Uh, so if you've had a birthday between today and July sixth and last week, June 29th, please let me know in the chat right now. Right now, I'm not doing I'm not doing this for 20 minutes like we did last week, but I will do it briefly as we talk just a little bit. Uh, Theater Monkey says, so you guys used a projector for the diamond? Looks great. No, that's not a projector. That's not, 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 not a projector, my friend. That is a real, we got, we got a real stage spotlight, uh, that fits some gobos. We, uh, um, yes, I, I know. It is an interlaced camera, you guys. Be cool. Please be cool. Uh, yes, it is, uh, it is an actual real stage spotlight. Uh, we had, we had our eyes on one, on one model and then, uh, Corey, I guess, got this one. Um, quicker, cheaper, second hand, and uh, it, it's it's great. Oh, is that Thug in the chat? Hey, Midwestern Thug. By the way, ooh, I gotta get some plugs in here on Friday. Marbles is back here on twitch.tv slash night attack. Please don't ask. We haven't changed. We're not changing the name just yet. Um, all right, birthdays. Let's see here. Uh, oh, of course, America had a birthday on July 4th. Of course, happy birthday, America. Uh, let's see. Mbombo Cube's marriage was 17 years ago. Happy birthday to Mbombo Cube's marriage on the 3rd. Uh, let's see here. Let's see here. Let's see here. Let's see here. Uh, uh, Math and Nugs' birthday was June 29th. Last week? Last on last week's episode? Oh wow. Okay. I don't. I don't know if we give you two or not. Uh, Nick House says my sister's was June 30th. Happy birthday to Nick House' sister. Uh, Aussie Rob on June 30th. Happy birthday, Aussie Rob. Um, ba, 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 ba. All right. Well, thank you everybody for joining us here on the pre-show and for the birthdays. Ah, someone says we should do DDR as punishment. Well, A, DDR is not punishment. It is a lot of fun. I'm trying to think how we would do that. How would we do that? Because, because Step Mania, hey, guess what? They haven't really, they haven't really, they haven't really, uh, they're really not updating Step Mania very much anymore. Um, I think they have play. I think there are teams of people doing it. There are people, and that's the other thing, Nick with the C. Brian like did DDR in the past. Now Justin runs. He, he may not, and Ashley's played a lot. I maybe mean, he's picked up some of it. But then uh, thinking about like, the, the, uh, I don't know. We could check it out. I think we could check it out. That might be fun. But it's fun. That's the thing is, I th I think it's fun. I use it for exercise. I hit that shit one two hours. Uh, like it's it's great. That's great. I don't know. That's that's just me. For me, for me, it would be the reward. Um, but we do have a, a a good game coming up here in just a bit. We got, uh, as you heard earlier, Brett, the Amtrak around Seville. Uh, and of course, uh, uh, Brett with Brett Weaver will continue to join us uh, every week, pretty much. <laughs> Thug says, "Wow, Bryce is exercising." <laughs> Look, I'm, I I am I am 
I, 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 I'm not talking about it because nobody cares, but I, I am like exercising some more. I'm really killing it. I, no, nope, nobody cares. Nobody cares. Um, Jiggy James B says, I don't DDR. I don't like the music enough. Ah, interesting. You know, but that's where Step Mania comes in. Step Mania, uh, there's a PC version and you can download all of the stuff. Um, the new, it used to be, it used to be the website you would go to was Bimani style.com and then that got shut down not for like a copyright or anything but i think just there was drama or something so now i think it's uh xenius i vanisher or something like that um uh let's see renagu says ddr is outdated germany is unified now i see i see i see uh people are saying that they that, that they want to listen so we so uh something that i've i uh uh, some, something that I uh, um, uh, did today, uh, if, if we're just going to talk about it briefly, uh, is I, I've been working out the legs the past couple of days. Uh, Sunday I had a dedicated leg strength day, and then uh, uh, Monday I went and did a, this awful outdoor walk. No, yes, yeah, yesterday. Um, and so my legs are still really sore, but you know what, what actually ended up being a good trick was... Uh, the elliptical, the elliptical at, uh, in my little uh, little fitness room that I go to, um, has, is great because I the thing that I can't do is impact. I, I can't do. I, I have a really tough time with road impact. Treadmills, treadmills a little finer because it's mostly plastic and they kind of make it a little easier. But street running, I can't do. And so the elliptical, where you not only like don't have foot impact, it's like a lot of momentum. Um, and so it wasn't really, it wasn't necessary. I mean, it was mostly, it was like leg anyway, no, nah, nobody really cares about this, but, um, but that was interesting. Cause I never thought about using an elliptical just as, uh, as, as running. I felt, I, 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 I almost felt dumb at first just being on the elliptical and not using the treadmills. Um, and then by the time, by the time I got to like 10 minutes in, I was like, I really don't care. I'm going to, I would just like mouthing the j-pop that i'm listening to uh man mouthing music also another pro tip beep, 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 is uh if if you got a music if you a if you got a good playlist but b it's one that you could sing could sing to but don't because you're in a public space uh mouthing the words helps me breathe better i actually am like not um uh like I, i'm not i'm not, i'm not always great about it And so that is uh, that's a that's a fun little trick. Midwestern Thug says I only listen to the Himbo Hams playlist on on leg day. Oh yeah, that's it's it's a good it's a good playlist for lifting. Um, it's not good for cardio because you kind of you have the trick with the Himbo Hams playlist, which you can find on Spotify if you look up Neshcom, uh, the user there. I've got it there. Uh, some music that I play during marbles, but. Uh, what you what you gotta do is you gotta skip a lot. You gotta skip through a lot. a lot of those songs are old and long and like all of the heats right at the beginning. So you kind of just have to keep up 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 up. Um, you know, if you're doing intervals or something. Curtis says I just sing because I enjoy embarrassing myself. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I I did feel a little, but they the fitness room is kind of everything's kind of oriented in one direction so i knew i was like at the window and there wasn't anybody in front of me and there, there really wasn't going to be anybody looking like directly 90 degrees at me um for a extended period of time so that mouthing mouthing kurumeta riku hello everybody we're gonna get started here in about three minutes thank you so much dan 33 says the cardio is in the skipping I feel like that would be way worse, right? When doesn't that just make the impact? That's that's the problem I have is the impact, not the not the cardio. But oh, what do I know? What do I know? Um, let's see. Oh, I needed to pull up a couple of things over here on this computer so that the fellas can see it. Ba 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 ba. I'm gonna pause, play, and pause. Um, but we got we got some good topics for you here tonight. We're gonna have uh, uh, we're gonna have some fun. Uh, and some as you heard, as you heard, we got us we got some, we got some special guests. Not just Brett, not just the Bretts. We have a special guest, so that'll be fun. Uh, you know, last week last week the guys came in here and then they just waited right there until it was time to go. <laughs> 
I'm, I, I, how would you describe it? I'm anxious. I'm anxious. Uh, let's see. Sign asks, how did you convince the boys to do a show on the rails? Oh, with, with like pre, pre-planned stuff? I mean, <laughs> I mean, it's, uh, hey, it wasn't, it, it, I don't believe it was my idea. I think it would, might've been Justin and or Brian's. I think, uh, we, we may, I, I don't know, at some point we'll talk a little bit about the conceptualization process, but, um, I know at one point we were, um, we were pretty strong, we felt pretty strong almost on, um, kind of aping the old, on Vice, the, the, the Desus and Mero, uh, style. Um, I just think it's, it's interesting and it's really cool for a very simple production, you know, them in like two nice you know, armchairs and they get the, the big bear wearing the Tims behind them. And, um, you know, I think it's, it's only, I think that's also only two cameras, I believe. Um, and so, so that is, that is some of, some of the inspiration that we took. And, and one of the things that they do there is they've got, uh, a headlines or topics, um, kind of table of content. So it, it, it just ended up feeling like, okay, I mean, you've, I'm sure you've heard, uh, uh, especially Brian talk about the, the bane of asking what what everybody did over the last week um, and so uh, it turns out the way that you don't have to do that is if um, you have r written a podcast <laughs> to do instead <laughs> and so um, all right, I'm on where are these boys it is 659 Where is everybody? Motherfuckers? I don't know. Justin, Justin, Justin looked at me like he was on fire. Where, the, where is everybody? Come on. We're doing a show. We're doing a show. There we go. Hello. Oh, did you get your mic? Hey. I will. Remember, snake number eight. Yes. Snake number eight. Uh, hello, everybody. Come on. What's up? I, I don't know what it is. He's, he's. He's twerking? I believe he's twerking. He's doing, he's doing, he's, he was doing this to me. So, uh, hello everybody. We're gonna get started here in just a few minutes. Midwestern Thug says, not to brag, but I have 1.4K in Bryce Bucks. Oh, you got Bryce Bucks. Uh, so, so, right. So we'll have you. Uh, that's, uh, where we'll have you be. Uh, hello, hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Uh, hello, everybody. Um, but we'll, we'll get started here. Yeah, uh, what is Bryce Bucks? Doug, where did you get my Bryce? Where did you get Bryce Bucks from? Um, someone says Bryce is a hologram. Thermos Jack says he got the same shirt. Oh, there's Brett. Hello, Brett. What? What? Hi. No, just keep <laughs> I got, uh, yeah, this is just a PlayStation shirt I got from H&M, I think. Got from H&M. Hello, everybody. Everybody feeling good? Yeah. All right. Uh, all righty. Well, then uh, we'll, we'll, we'll get started here with the Great Night uh, program. Uh, yeah, that's right. That's the show. Um, and so, yeah, that'll be a lot of fun. Uh, oh, Thug says Bryce Bucks are points, but to me, they're Bryce Bucks. Ah, well, there we go. Uh uh, Weaver, would you mind tapping that mic for me? Weaver, please. Yes. Thank you very much. Okay. All right, everybody, we are going to get in position to start the Great Night Podcast. Here we go.